And we are live here with the Death Blossoms One Day Banhammer Tournament. I am FBI Tugboat, casting with me is Iris. Down producing away is Deluxity, making our job just so much easier. Iris, how are we doing today? I'm doing pretty good. How about yourself? I'm, I'm doing great. I'm casting Death Blossoms tournaments. Can't, can't awesome be better. Time. Yeah. So for um, a couple of the rules here, Iris, you want to run over those with me while we get set up here on King's Row? Yeah, so this is a bit of a unique one. We're going to be, uh, when a team loses a map, they're going to ban two heroes for the winning team for all subsequent maps. Uh, there must be two heroes reigning each category, so you can't ban all the support heroes, for instance. So that's uh, a little bit easier than just pure banning. Um, so it should be pretty interesting. I've never played Overwatch with any kind of rule with that, and it'll be interesting to see how the teams handle it. Yeah. Um, yeah. So especially if you know one of these teams, uh, this is Mjolnir on the left in blue, and Stormbreakers over here on the right. Both pretty evenly matched SRs. Um, so you know, it, th this makes it possible for if one of these teams like really doesn't like you know dual snipers, something like that, dive comp, or, or the infamous goats, they can you know ban here is appropriate to to take those out of uh, you know possible picks. So yeah, we're and I think that might uh, be very important for this uh, particular set of uh, individuals, but. We'll these particular see. set of individuals. Uh, I'm assuming you know them very well, yeah. yeah. Um, I, I believe I've seen Van uh, on Widow before, and it's, uh, it's been terrifying. So it'll be interesting to see if they ban the, say, two snipers, that, you know, how that how, how that will affect the game. Well, yeah, well, it's also like which two snipers now, right? Because we do have Ash in now, so it's like, you know, obviously Widowmaker's one, but Ash Ponzo? You know, you could, I mean, the, the argument's always made about McCree, but I think it's pretty solid, you know, now it's just kind of between, you know, Ash or Hanzo. Yeah, well, yeah I, I, I would say it's definitely got to be Widow Ash if they ban both snipers, but we'll see. It. Maybe they'll play around it better and won't need to. Um, I definitely feel like Widow might get a, a good ban, so. I like the defensive symmetry here. They have that teleporter. There's just a lot more, uh, a lot more, uh, uh, a lot more mobility and stuff up now. Yeah, it'll, it'll be interesting. Uh, let's look at some of them in the back there. <laughs> Take care of that. Um, the, the Symmetra is um, very powerful on the first point because the, uh, of course, the, the shield ultimate, which charges up fairly quickly. If you know what you're doing. So that's, that's going to be a nasty charge. The Broad Broad going to fall first here. Main tank now down for the side of Mjolnir's. Nice little res coming in while the attention is off. Toki Bear with all the awareness in the world. Zan starting to pop up there on that Widowmaker. Cloud Sky is going to fall. Some well-placed Symmetra shots and turrets alike. We see U UFO here almost up to full ultimate. Looks like Zan's getting in position up there by that teleporter. Couldn't go back with the team though. Yeah, oh, um, looks like they're actually not going to quite go all the retreat all the way. Going to try to be a little sneaky. Yeah, trying to force a little bit of space here, make it so that the defense can't uh, take like the small, uh, the small health hack right there. Uh, they do want to get that hacked here, coming on into the rest of the attack. Yeah, let's see. Uh, Smash was already up to that ultimate there. That's the reason that's so important is it's basically the only way to hold this first point. I found once the, once the, uh, and the uh, attackers have their ultimate, there comes that ultimate from Smash. There you go, call it, and it'll happen. Diva's out on the other side and. Ha that nano up, but that's not gonna be enough. Deleted down by Nami and an entire cadre of the older members. Forcing out the trans here as the broad broad does get a little bit low. Again, that's the main tank here for them. Shattered down, but that's really only gonna get uh well that's gonna be get the main tank I mean uh, support there. Now charging back to broad broad kind of on the back lines getting badgered by this Lucio. That might be a hard loss. Yeah, and then taking off by I'm sorry? And uh Zanthi taking off by Symmetra. Yeah, I mean, they, the res is just a little bit far back. Oh, there's the shatter. This might set up a nasty swing oh, coming on in. Nasty. Yeah, yeah. EMP shattered before. Sound barrier now to curse. Makes things certain here. Nani getting very low. But a grab might come out with Zar Zar Sorry, Zadka's still up. I'm not sure if that's going to be enough. Zan is still showing prowess on that Widowmaker. Shots come out. But now DeBrod brought his back. And Choki Bear. Oh, no. Shield not high enough to get that one. Main support now down. These two tanks are fighting without heals. They're doing a great job of contesting. Zadka has been up there for 30 seconds or so. That's going to be into that one, though. Yeah, that was a great contest from the uh, from defenders really there. It was. Really it's was. Nancy pushing up a little bit with uh, Lego there. Very, well, yeah, very I mean, aggressive I mean, uh, attack kind of combination with Symmetra uh, Widow, especially with Zanthi's Widow, which is very aggressive in your face. Yeah, UFO now is here and answers Zan in kind. Uh, yeah, getting denied there. Yeah, right? Send him back to respawn and make him think about that decision. Let's go now on over the Hanzo. There's that dual snipers we were talking about. Yeah, 
Yeah, it, it looks like the you know the the Sombra is not probably as important now that they're uh, especially with switching off of say Symmetra. So yeah, uh, hacks are great. I mean, hacks are just great against everyone. We see this really pressuring up in the front, kind of coming on back. Oh, Zan down, but gets one in kind again. Oh UFO God. with awareness. Well done. Grab now down. They have three members in. Ah, oh, then uh, Zadko is trying to get that up, but with that shield in, not a whole lot to be done. Lego taking out UFO here. This sniper battle ensues. Yeah, both teams having a number of alts. They're all coming out now. Ooh, like, Nadi uh, getting taken wow. out. I thought it was better. Oh, it's massive. Yeah, it really is. That's gonna be Rebel Rose and Broad Broad deleted down from that. Zadka taking a shot to the face as well. We see the offense rolling here, Iris. Yeah. They're just, they're just, it, they're just kind of taking every fight. It, they're just, the uh, defenders are putting up like a, a pretty good, um, a, they're getting pretty good trades, and then mm -hmm. at some point the attackers are just taking the fight. Uh. Oof. When you start Ooh. team fights like that, it's not going to go well. Nani got deleted down a second ago trying to make it 12 o'clock here. He's going to have a res up. They're not going to have that in the next 30 seconds. The sand does fall. Little monkey action in the front. UFO out with the headshots, but here's Dragons on the point. Answering it with a transcendence is the exact thing to do. Set the truck mostly going to be for a remake here, but Rain Monkey and Queen deleted down after Zack could take down his counterpart. Rain is doing a great job of contesting here. Ah, but with many members on, that's not going to be enough for her. And defenders win their uh, first fight. Yeah, so one minute forty three seconds, and and a great place to do it too, right? Yeah, before that second point. Just, is and it with quite enough space actually? I always get this wrong. Is it an extra a minute and a half or two minutes? Do they I have through? no idea. I don't have that memorized. Probably should. So. Yeah, I, I I probably should too. I, I I get like little numbers and stuff like that mixed up a lot. Oh well. It's enough being way. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's all that's important. Exactly. Hey, hey, there you go. There you go. That's what it is. Winston coming on over the top, uh, kind of forcing on back this, yeah, at least one of those snipers. That was Zan or, uh, you know, Lego's now down bottom. Zan is back, though. Zan's right behind him, shooting away. And you see, oh. uh, pulling Diva out there. Diva's D Max there. Uh. Ramus is Nana Boost, and she is scary, swinging Both away and trying split. to find some. Oh, Toki Bear, she barely gets away here. Remus is now down, not a whole lot, self-destruct over on the side, isn't going to find anything there, UFO is going to have that, those walls now falling, after getting a big headshot, that's exactly what they need to do. Here comes a dragon. That's mostly on the point, uh, yeah, the, the supports are kind of kept back there, but, and with Zanka, you know, kind of left by yeah, herself, this. gets the damage down, Lego gets a headshot in the middle of everything though, big shatter, big shatter, multiple this ones laid down by that. Yeah, and they're still stalling out this point. They're still stalling out this point. They're um, under 30 seconds. That's what they're doing. There's the, yeah, there's the Mercy Ultimate. That leads to two picks against them. Zan continuing on the theme, getting these headshots. Rubber Rose also down. They're fighting pretty evenly here, Iris. Yeah, this this fight this fight never ends. I would have yeah. said that they, they were about to lose this fight, but, the, you know, they came in the Oh, five round. seconds. Oh, and, nobody's here. Oh, gosh. Nobody's oh, left. Oh, they attacked and touched in time. Oh, oh didn't oh. try overtime. Oof. Yeah. Yeah, you hate to see it. Yeah, I, I think it's I think it's three seconds that you have to t again. It's it's one of those minute details that, uh, that that I can't exactly remember all the time. I think you have to touch it within three seconds to trigger overtime. Um, but defense just really did a great job there. Uh, Toki Bear with her mercy ultimate in there. Uh, it, it, you know the damage boosted or the the healing boost. Excuse me. Now on the ultimate and group did exactly what they needed to. Indeed. The Stormbreaker is now um, going to be on the defense themselves. Uh, yeah, and bands come after each map. So, so far, what would you think uh, that Mjolnir's would ban? Mjolnir's now. Um, Left side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you know, I I would have said, you know, they're clearly going to start ban banning Widow because yeah. I've just seen Xanthi dom dominate in previous games. But I uh, honestly, I have no idea now. It didn't really feel like anyone was particularly <laughs> aggressively dominating in that game. They did a pretty good job of kind of countering every everybody. Um, and, you know, the, the mm -hmm. I, I can't think of any bans that would particularly benefit one team over the other at this point. Um, yeah, that, that's kind of what I was thinking, because UFO was playing the Widow too, and she was finding a lot of value in it. 
yeah, there was a ton of value coming out of UFOs Widow. There, um, so like trying to get somebody off their main DPS is not particularly uh, gonna gonna work for them. Um, you Ooh. might see something weird like trying to ban the Torb or something like that just to kind of get rid ban of that. I, I, the maybe ban Brig just to be Mimi. Yeah, yeah. ban Brig. <laughs> Delete Brig. Um, yeah, uh, that, 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 that'd be straight in on that turret. Yeah, yeah, Lego's not gonna have one up there. Uh, now with Zach getting his mech down, this is, a lot, this is not a good day for machines, we'll say so far. The broad broad also getting deleted down, trading back and forth, Zan finding her counterpart, UFO taking the headshot on that one after UFO started this game with one of her own. Yeah, you know, the, uh, Queen Galaxy on the, uh, on the Zen there, it's gonna be really great to have a Zen and Widow combo on both teams. Uh, that's that's really gonna maybe help with those uh, kind of matchups. The sniper battle ensues. Zan finding one of her Aww. own. We see five tank coming around the back. Toki Bear is able to get her res up. Well done there. Not gonna happen for the next thirty seconds though. This Mercy ult coming on. Oh, De Broad Broad coming on down without her Diva. Rain Monkey now getting deleted on that mech. Zadka, or sorry, Zadka getting deleted on that mech. Coming on back, but that baby, yeah, that big blaster is uh, big blaster is uh, rolling. Indeed. It's either the Tor uh, mini diva battle, uh, unlike yeah, the matchup. Uh, yeah, yeah, right outside the, I think, the, yeah, the Alderworth Hotel. The Alderworth yeah. Hotel, indeed. Indeed. The way Zadka's shooting, she's gonna have that diva mech back very soon. Yeah, she's 97% now. Dropping on down. I thought really just playing the interrupt game. Dragon's on like down. Here comes the dragon, way. trying to force them to split the teams off. You can see that Molten Core comes out, though, trying to. Fill that area that they used they split with the dragon. Radimus with the charge hitting this diva Zan kid getting taken out of her mech just as soon as she got in. Zan again continuing to find her heads. Yeah, you know maybe that widow companion that widow pick might be uh, in their favor. I, I I'll say that it would make for an entirely different game. Both again with UFO playing her her playing her heart out and Zan doing the, doing the same on the other side. Indeed, indeed. Yeah, you see that switch, Rebel Rose switching to Moira, looking for healing, um, rather than that kind of maybe low healing, uh, Mercy, uh, Zen combo. Somebody can heal the, the kind of yeah, more yeah. people at once there. Self-destruct! Oh! oh Zack, uh, finding three, Raiden is falling shortly thereafter. That's gonna set up for an easy take by the offense. <gasps> oh, did Broad Broad is able to get out of that one? Yeah, 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 yeah. But that's gonna be okay. Uh, Zad can mech as well, because we, we've seen how quickly Zad can get back in her mech. Yeah, they just want to stall at the point a little bit longer here and give themselves yeah. the best possible chance. And that's the name of the game. Zan finding one there at the end, though. She's just there. You go. And then you have goes Zan. I feel like a broken record, Iris. Zan <laughs> yeah, finding Zan finding one under the under the DPS of uh, Mjolnir's, and then yeah, you have right. finding that head immediately afterwards. Yeah. And, and shout out, yeah, shout out to both of these mercies. They've really been pulling some really crazy reses in the middle of everything and pulling them off, not getting you know booped away, interrupted, or or, or killed in the middle of any of them. So far, and you know that's what that's what makes the difference. That's why you pull that mercy in there in the first place. <laughs> Gonna start in with and the again, dragon. Here. Yeah, and again after UFO gets taken out, or after UFO takes out Zan, Zan finds one of them. Red's coming on up there. This diva doing exactly what she needs to to you know cover her mercy while she's uh, while she's resing. Well done. Good awareness. Oh, here comes a massive earth shatter. Shatter down. That's me too quickly. UFO. Getting a, a nice little punch on in there, Zan getting res, so that's gonna be Rainimus only one down for the Stormbreakers. Defense probably winning this team by two minutes forty seconds. There's loads of time on left on the clock here though, Paris. And you can see each team is doing a really good job of kind of uh, trickling out their ultimates, not use like using them and kind of, seems like they're communicating pretty well about, you know, alt utilization and, and making sure that they're kind of engaging in the in the best possible way. Um, neither team has really shown that there's a clear ult advantage um, up to this point, although maybe the, the uh, attackers are going to now get that advantage. Yeah, well, Zaga on that, that with the big Diva 2K, I mean, like you said, that was, that was really the big one, and it wasn't mixed with, you know, three other ultimates. Uh, yeah. The only time, you know, support ultimates have really been dropped is when they absolutely need to. Again, we saw Toki Bear earlier, saw Cloud Sky over on her mercy as well as Zan. <laughs> Look at Zan he behind the good. enemy team, kicking off them from the back. If you, could, if you could keep counter this, I would really love to know that information. Because it is beyond numbers this caster can have at this point. 
Coalesce is coming on out here before Rebel Rose, really edging it out here and getting the damage on that Mercy ult on the other side, sorry, the Cloud Sky uh, pocket. Oh, there's a Substruct! Oh, that was perfectly though. pleased. Yeah, but, yeah, but, but uh, with so many corners here, it was able to, uh, you know, people were just able to get back. Zach getting super low! Ooh, Lego! It is a culling day for Lego. She finds herself too, and yeah, sends the attackers running. Yeah, and then picks off the rest. <laughs> yep. <sighs> that could Same Lego. There, there, there's a name that we can mix here. Uh, Legan? Yeah, there's something like that. This DPS, <laughs> this, this DPS combo has been doing a great job. I don't, I don't know that I, I don't know that Legan is the. But you know, they don't even have to push it that far. They're, they, you know. Halfway there, but they're they're not making any progress. I mean, I like this rotation around the side. Nani is now pressuring down the middle. De Broad brought down the middle. There's both Mercy Ultimate Dragon down the D middle. Oh, a nasty D mech indeed. But Charging Lego's and get him off from behind. Yeah, Lego's getting at the flank, and there's Zan and Lego again. Nasty res now. Nani is back to inflict damage of her own. Broad Broad getting deleted down there with the Discord orb on top. Oh, oh, coming back! Oh, but Zan shooting him from inside this, you know, like basically from the uh, from the stairs. So, yeah, defense taking this one again. Oh, Zan! Oh, well, gosh, Zan just on their own in the middle of the enemy team. Oh, but too too much, too much for Zan. Hey, yeah, no, it's too much for Toki Bear, right? She got tired of it. We got yeah, turn, on the, turn on the battle mercy. Yeah, turn on the battle mercy. That's that's what time it was. Lego has another. Oh my! Here that comes every possible there. ultimate. Yeah, it's overtime. Ah. That's the time for it. Yo, self destruct. Bob just stares him down, takes him to the face. He takes the full yeah, self destruct. Yeah. You have to admire the courageousness of old Bob here. Uh, Zan, uh, can you take? Can you go on? Lego finding two more, three more. Three more as long as possible. Oh, Jabron broad broad's broad back, broad. swinging oh, away. And instantly oh. kills. Maybe Toki Bear. No. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Only so much a single battle mercy. Can Okay. So Stormbreaker is taking this one here on King's Row. We'll be seeing which two characters are uh, are going to be uh, going to be banned currently. Um, well, yeah. we're ready for this tournament, I guess I should say. What a this, this is the big uh, this is the big three or four. Oh no, yeah, it was, the, like, yeah, uh, those three and for it, and then UFO got the thing. And they got right back in, right back in the thick of it. I love it. Yeah. Let's see. So, uh, yeah, we might take a short break while these two teams decide which uh, which two heroes. We'll be back with you guys in just a second.
And we are back in here with Oasis now in this best of five. We have our hero bands as well. Not going to be seeing any more Reapers, not going to be seeing any more Widowmakers. Between these two teams, Mjolnir on the left, Stormbreakers on the right. Here with me is Iris. Iris, we, we talked about it a lot, didn't we? Yeah, we talked about it quite a bit, and, you know, now it's here. Widow's out. Widow's out. Not making any more, uh, not making any more big, uh, big headshots and stuff. That's yeah, one I, of the, uh, one of the snipers. Yeah, I like Oasis. Do you like Oasis? I love control points, Iris. Like, I love King's Row too. don't get me wrong. Like, the hands down my favorite, like, hybrid, I would mm -hmm. say. I like Nemani a lot, too. But I like control points in general. And I'm well, like I think that typical Overwatch. Yeah, right. I'm like that typical Overwatch player who, like, craps on 2CP. Yeah. Uh, well, I, I, we I'll never get to see them that. in Death Blossom tournaments because they always pick them as the tiebreaker and avoid them. <laughs> 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 they always give us they always give us two CP instead of uh and so that we get four ties. <laughs> Ugh. Oh well, oh well. We you know we like you kinda of like we were just talking about. Well, no, I I, I guess plans for future but uh, we we have intra an interesting tournament format that would benefit casters we'll say that uh that you might that you uh, beautiful people might see soon <laughs> little yeah. pharmacy combination coming on out here by stormbreakers we'll see how that can really pop up for him Ooh, Ooh. that going up early yeah, is that could get a nice pick on the mercy yeah uh right right over in the, and oh and there you go follows it up with lego up in the sky called a no-fly zone this point opened up in a couple seconds. My owner is gonna be all over it. Zan takes out Toki, but that's that's not gonna be enough with their whole team dead. Yeah, they're um they're running two main supports, so you know getting in there is possible. It's just gonna be it's just gonna require a lot of coordination, right? Oh, well, now they're gonna switch uh, run a Lucio uh, Mercy. Yeah, so actually Queen Galaxy hearing me, Caster's Curse indeed. No more two main supports. Ooh, the Rod Rod been caught out there. Raynum is following it up. Pick on the Rebel Rose. Get Nami down. But 20%, 25. Uh, they have this Doomfist here, UFO. The DPS. Oh. It's yeah, got Radimus. a lot of damage in so far. Oh, sorry, go ahead. Yeah, Raiden is getting so charged there, just doing so much damage. Yeah, I, I liked UFO stalling out as long as they could. You know, um, it's it's really just all about time here. Yeah, you see, uh, Lego switched on a tracer, uh, hide, hiding around the side here, hoping to hoping to get some kind of nice little engage. But that kind of looks like Steezer? Maybe not. I can imagine the stick onto the opposing Moira app. Fade is going to be the big thing. Oh, Zan winning the little uh, little battle of the West here with the rival McCree, right? Yeah, and a little bit of a tracer, uh, somber battle. Nobody gets taken out though. Lego takes out Rebel Rose and takes out Barbara with the Bob. Bob coming out. So yeah, now Cloud is Sky down, but Zan is popping off. Uh, yeah, she yeah she played the Widowmaker last time. I guess Ash is not that far from her forte. Well, 48, yeah, forty nine percent. Ash is just great, you know, and. Uh... That's exactly what I expected to see after they banned Widow. Just switch on to the, uh... You literally called it. Well, you know, and, and Ash might actually be more of a threat for them because of Ash's ultimate being much more powerful. Like, Wallhax is pretty powerful if you're a great Widow, but Bob literally oh. can take the points on his own. Ooh, Lego setting that one up. Little, uh, grabbing the back. Oh my god. Raidim is getting taken out kind of at the edge of the range. Oh my god. Yeah, that was a really yeah, yeah that's a little, little far out there. But Raiden is gonna be the only one taken out. Cloud Sky is gonna give the res on her teammate. But we're gonna see this Mjolnir team coming back. Ultimates in hand. This is last team fight though. Yeah, only one more fight left. Eighty nine percent. They gonna get on that point. And here they come. They've got three alts, almost four alts, five alts actually. You can pull all of those alts out. Here comes that EMP. Yeah, he got a couple of members. Comes that Earth Shatter, kills their There's the diva. Shatter! Taking the baby diva out as Sound Bear oh, does they're gonna, fall. They're gonna get a res. Clouded Sky, you mad woman! Oh, 12 o'clock here for Raidimus as Clouded Sky does fall abroad abroad, getting those swings away. Toki Bear getting one of her own. And now with that that D mech, I think the Mjolnir's, yep, they're gonna take it. 32, 33% now against 99. Well done. Yeah. 
they have to hold this the entire time though. They've got they can't lose any fights at this point. But that's pretty hard they with two ults. Uh, they use yeah, the ultimate to all the value in the world, right? Yeah, they use they use all their ultimates. They get the point, but they're gonna have to go up against uh, two, uh, maybe three in a bit uh, ultimates from the uh, attackers. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, the heck, on, on their side, what? Choki Bear, Debrod, Broad, Nami, all, what, 75 above on their ultimates? That's yeah, they're getting right back up there. Yeah, yeah, straight, yeah, absolutely. Ooh! Denied. That's sick! Nah, yeah, you're not gonna get anything from that one. Ooh, big shatter here. Charge to follow it up as the damage just pour on to Rain Monkey. Debrod, Broad, Broad, on back a little bit, but this Ash is sectioned off! Zan, not able to get the big shots onto the tank. That's just uh, too much damage at once with the swings on top. Yeah, Lego's Please. trying to put that pressure on there, trying to get them to open up those shots, but it's not, but they're, they're not, they're not gonna listen to it. Yeah, Toki Bear has that coalescence. Zadka very close to EMP, and this defense in the position they need to be with the most ultimates on board. Now have five, there's the EMP. 12 o'clock, searching for it. Oh, Debrava. Out by Zan again. Uh, yeah, exactly. This is down to the wire here. Now, Sound Bear is down for both teams. There's the grab. Nami is going to be the one in it. Coalescence coming out, trying to keep him up. But Nami driving in is going to get taken out quickly. Coalescence trying to edge out here. But this Lucio doing a great job. Queen Galaxy, the master of her realm, is Zan getting taken out by the nasty headshots. These teams are fighting pretty evenly here. Rebel Rose with the speed as well to force or to allow her team to get a little bit farther around. Oh, There's the shatter. That might be it, especially against the main support. Sorry, is so low. Oh, Raiden is swung away on Lego down. Queen Galaxy deleted first one after a long one. Going to go to Mjolnir. Nerf this. Oh, wow. What a, what a comeback. <laughs> it really was. It really was. Uh, that, yeah, that, that was uh, literally from 99 to 0. All the way back up. You don't get more. Uh, you don't get. Uh, you don't get more dramatic, than that, man. I love it. Yeah, you don't. You don't. You get, don't get a more exciting fight than that. Absolutely. This is Gardens, I think. Oasis Gardens. I'm really bad with names. On. I, I don't know the names of the sub levels because the game doesn't tell you. Yeah. I mean, it does no, tell fair. you, but, but like. It well, it doesn't. It doesn't say it in like uh, what, what is what is the what is the computer's name? Uh, Athena, I think. Athena, yeah. It doesn't. It doesn't say it. I just yeah, get them all confused because like they look different. They like Oasis, Man, and Gardens. It's their fault. That's what we'll say. Yeah, we'll, we'll blame it on that. Exactly. Um, Blizz, please fix. Uh, Overwatch literally unplayable. How dare you? <laughs> yeah, you know, uh, University <laughs> is my favorite phase of this map. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, there's a lot of boob capabilities there too. I'm a loser. Zan popping off already. I think we might. Uh, I think we might know who their next band hero might be for the side of well, the owners. Yeah, maybe. Like, that's uh. Well, we'll have to see who wins. Though. Well, look, they run the dual sniper again, and Lego and Zan both higher than eighty percent ultimate now. Yeah, I think Zan yeah. started this with two kills. Yeah. Well, you know that. They're losing any capability of banning anybody else, but again, who else would you want to ban? It, they're not really organized around snipers like that, and you know you don't want to ban your supports, you don't want to ban your tanks. Ooh, random is getting hacked. It's not going to bode well for the damage is coming in. These supports, all the awareness again. Well done there. Now with Rez coming out for Zadka for the other side. Is Lego getting the damage out? There's the big AMP though. Dragons have fallen. Everyone gets away from that one. Down Bear now dropped. It's Queen Galaxy keeping her team up. Bob is over oh, the side. That's have him out. Oh, out of two big ones. Yeah, Rebel Rose UFO. Feel the heat from that one. And you just saw uh, Baby Diva get charged by Ravens. It's going straight in. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. But, I mean, sometimes you just gotta, you know, put them down. You know, uh, I mean, Baby Divas are so used to getting staggered now, right? Like getting yeah, taken out yeah. and like having to go jump off of, having to like literally go like self defense. Yeah, you know, they got a, a really nice big EMP there um, from Zadka, but they, they didn't have enough to really engage on it, and they were able to get their ultimates back off right after that time, time limit right now. Oh, the big dragons! Oh, there's the charge too! Rain Monkey almost falling to a Baranimus again with the awareness, shatters, charges back, and that shatter is gonna, yep. 
Rod Scott, or, sorry, Rod Rod is a uh, knows who his target or who her targets are. Excuse me. Oh yeah. no! Almost edging it out there. She almost got away the charge all the way down there, but that res is going to come back up. Toki Bear, continuing on this theme of these mercies, get the nasty res is off. Yeah, and again, they have to hold this point. 89%. That's very. That's almost very 99, iffy. yeah. Yeah, that's very iffy. But unlikely that they, they, they just did it, though, right? The cap after if that got flips. They just did it, though, right? Uh, they were a little bit lower. Oh, no, yeah, that's right. There was 99. Yeah, if they, if yeah, they got yeah. pushed off the map, they wouldn't have time to respawn. Here comes another big EMP, unable to use that chatter. That's gonna be too much for their Ryan. Broad, broad with another big charge. Diva's now the Lucy out of was mech. there. Diva one hit goes out of that. Oh, not quite. Oh. Though. Lane Lucky kills Broad, broad. Clouded Sky, well done. Just like with the straight pocket, I love it. She has that Valkyrie ultimate as well. Um, and, and I mean, just Ra uh, Raidenus, or, or sorry. Did I get this wrong? You know, yeah, yeah. Broad, broad was up there swinging away, but I mean, you know, Mercy's healing is gonna outdo Lucio's healing every day, all day. What happened to Xanthi there? She jumped off the map to reset, or...? I'm not 100% sure. It might have just been a reset. That's what we'll call it. A strategic reset. Strategic reset, yes. Strategic reset. Here's the dragons. Mm -hmm. the, 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 or bomb. Ooh. Oh, take out the Mercy. Clouded Sky has just been really feeling the brunt of these DPS ultimates from the side of Mjolnir, like, all day. There's the big shatter! Dragons to try and answer! Lego is, uh, yeah, following up with his team here. Raidimus does get taken out, but UFO and Lego both fighting some headshots of their own. Toki Bear falling a little bit late there. Lego taking out her counterpart. Little Hanzo on Hanzo action. 89% about to get taken back. Zach has to get out of this point. Don't know a little bit if they want to get another chance here. Rebel Rose, she's almost there. She's got the speed boost, 97. Oh, they managed to get back. Yeah, that's going to trigger overtime for this. Oh, here comes a Bob, though. That's a big bob! That's a bad oh. bob! Oh no! No, no. Not gonna earn or end well. Nami is here. She's trying to contest as long as possible. So truck over the side. Gonna take out the baby diva and uh, and force back the rest. Still here though. Rebel Rose has the sound barrier with this uh, with this battle mercy. Toki Bear is back in the before. Here comes oh. a Hammond to keep this fight going. Ramus actually take out. Uh, Toki Bear, as she was trying to get her res off, there's the EMP. This might be what they need. Nah, not gonna oh, matter. Oh, not quiet. You know, if uh, UFO almost got that big, uh, the big dragons down the middle. Yeah. If that, if that had been, uh, that was that was almost it between the EMP and the dragons. Yeah, it was so close. It was so close. It really was. But we're gonna get to see my favorite phase of this map. Oh yeah, little university action. So Iris, what what what, uh, what characters do you play? Um, all of them. But uh, I I've I've been uh, uh I'm most, like my favorite my favorite character is Tracer, but I, I'm not good enough gotcha. to consistently play her, and she she's been out of meta for a while. So yeah, that's very, that's very true. Yeah, the addition of Brig and uh, I hear you on that. I hear you on that. Yeah. So, but I like Tracer. I, I basically play all the hits games. Um, I've been. Uh, branch out. What about you? Um, so we do have a Reaper here. Um, hmm. I thought that that was, uh, maybe yeah, it's wait. just uh, Is it the, banned? Uh... I thought it was banned for both camps, but we weren't actually told specifics. Wait, the uh, caster's not told specific details? I don't yeah. think that's ever happened. <laughs> I'm just playing. Of course not, never. Rebel is following a little bit early here. Raidimus getting the damage off now. Not tank for Mjolnir's is going to get down, but Zadka's answering in kind with UFO um, as well. Toki Bear trying to get the... Okay, so yeah, it's looking like Reaper is only... Uh, Reaper is only banned for the Stormbreakers, and Widow is banned for the Mjolnir's. No, I think it's just banned. I think they're both banned from uh, um, from from the. Uh, uh, no. Losers ban winning team only from playing your team. Yeah, so so Stormbreaker, so the the uh, they're both banned for Stormbreaker. Stormbreakers can't use under. Okay. Um, cool. That makes the that makes the calculus a little bit different. Yeah, it does. I, yeah. It was 
gonna be able to... that, that's a little too much math for this uh, for this simple minded caster. <laughs> There's the coalescence coming on in. I, I... shatter now well, down. All comes out, gonna... so we're gonna clean it up. Yeah, that's a big shatter. Uh, Nami getting that one down and lots of damage coming on. Broad Broad as well. Oh, there you go. I I, I wasn't sure if that was gonna get on with the uh, on the baby beaver. Yeah, you see those hacks on Raven is doing a lot of work. Uh, one thing, you know, that Ash has that dynamite, and the teams are so great that that can do a lot of damage, and that's probably why they pick up switches over to that Lucio to kind of give themselves oh, some kind UFO. of counter healing for that. UFO's right there. Has the death blossom. There it is. Oh, oh no. Calling it like the weather. Oh, that sucks. That was, that was like. Was just she was just literally like hanging out right there around that corner, just waiting for the uh, waiting for the Reinhardt to come all around, uh, getting a big 2k. Bubble <laughs> Rose Zan is right there. You can boop her up now. Oh, it looks like for that. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, so Zan getting taken out here. This uh, Stormbreaker team gonna be fighting. Excuse me, one down for the time being. The, bro the broad, broad tip. Pull it now, keeping this team away. It's actually very, doing a very, very good job. Oh, Lego getting the damage boost of Hanzo shots, though. So the truck's on point. I think it's going to get blocked off. Yeah, Nami doing that job. Well done with that big old rectangle shield. Raidimus on the other side, though. Again, main tank deleted. Dragon's down. Oh, this Mjolnir team is barely gets away from a Coalescence coming out to make sure that they're going to keep this one for sure. Bob coming in the middle, though, and he gets stopped right in the middle. That's not going to bode well for this offensive team. Oh, he's got he almost booped off into down the center, but not quite. Uh, yeah, and I'm so all the way the other side. here for a Bob is just as good as killing him, because he's not going to be coming back. Does fall Bob afterwards. There's a shatter! Oh, no, here comes oh, the double the dragon. dragon! Oh, no! Oh, EMP, EMP to try though. and Raven even this one out! Reaper's going to crawl out with the Death Oh, this baby diva's going to be it! That's going down. I don't think that the Stormbreaker is going to be able to get there. What an electrifying end, Iris. I'm, I'm just speechless. That was <laughs> quite the end. You saw the, the Earth Shatter come out, and then the Rhine narrowly gets back up and gets an Earth Shatter of their own back in. <laughs> yeah, that was, uh, that was, that was something else. Um, now, who do you think, uh, Stormbreakers close. are gonna ban? Who will Stormbreakers ban? Mm, you know, if I just had to say... From okay, so I have two answers for you here, Zyrus. If the answer is what was the most effective there, the Sombra all day, period. Of course. Like, you know, against my owners. But if we're talking overall, I think you know, Diva I mean, um, uh, Nami on Diva was doing very, very well and I mean divas are so prevalent in so many compositions just because they can do so much, right? Like Movement abilities, defense matrix, which is a kind of a shield, kind of, you know, the ability to do sustained damage, and then a huge ultimate that you can, you know, toss, really combo with a whole lot of different things. Um, I, I, I wouldn't be surprised if we saw a little diva ban action coming on out. Yeah, you know, when I would, when we were assuming that they were banning from teams, you wouldn't really want to ban any of your tank options, because that would, that would limit you so much. But if you're just banning for the other team, then, you know, ban diva. Ban diva. There you go. Delete Diva, uh, Blizzard, you heard it here first. <laughs> and Diva, Van Ryan. Um, so, um, and, and I believe that one of the rules is that you can't, um, you can't ban more than two heroes from each category, or, or from the, the tank and support category. Uh, there has to be, yeah, I, I think you're, you have to leave two, or... I'm sorry? I, I think it was you had to leave two, but... Oh, you had to leave to. Okay, that would be a little bit different. That would, that would almost be like a, Let me a strategy that inside of a strategy, right? Like ban all the main supports. Uh, that would be interesting. That. There must be two heroes remaining. Yeah, you have to. Okay, okay, I'm about it. I'm here for it. Reaper and Sombra are banned for uh, Mjolnir, so that's the, okay, so the new ban. This is a best of five, meaning uh, that it could go. Well, and we're tied, actually, so there's going to be at least. Uh, at least three more, right? Three more? Uh, sorry, sorry, at least two more. It's a best of five, right? Yes. Okay, so at least two more, which means we could see one of these one of these games being played, yeah, with uh, with four support heroes uh, banned. It's possible, right? Well, I mean, it's 
if, if they I pick guess, him I here, guess, I guess yes. Um, if they pick him here in the next match, we could see a last match played with uh, only, and, and, and conversely, they could do the same thing to tanks. It really just depends on who's uh, who's made here. Well, right? they did. They didn't ban him here, so th there'd only be one. Th there wouldn't be a match played at the final match. So they could only ban two two support. Wasn't we're not one one right now? Well, we're one one, but. After, after, whoever, I'm trying, I'm trying to like yeah, I guess theoretically you could see it if they go to a fifth match. Yeah, 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 I'm trying to like, I'm yeah, trying that's, to like, that's what, if, if that's what you're saying, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, 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 okay, okay, cool. I knew I wasn't losing it quite yet. Um, okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I, I mean, again, the Sombra action coming on out here, uh, EMP is really set up for a lot of team fights to swing easily, like, one, one more way. Um, I was, but, and, and on the other side, Xan on the, uh, Zan on the on the ash, she she was killing it. Indeed, we won't get to see her off that ash quite yet. Okay, sorry. Here we go. Stormbreakers cannot play Widow and Reaper. Mjolnir's can't play Reaper and Sombra. Okay. Okay, cool. Let me just write this down real quick.
Arriving at Watchpoint, Gibraltar. And we are back, Death Blossom Overwatch Esports fans. I am FBI Tugboat. With me is Iris. Iris, what are we looking at? Uh, well, we're on Gibraltar. <laughs> <laughs> you big fan of Gibraltar, because I am not. I what? The picturesque Watchpoint Gibraltar. Look out here. Look at this. Look at this ocean. Oh the, Deluxe, you take the camera out here. Look, 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 yeah, yeah, your nice tanker transporting packaged goods from the, uh, you know, the Sea of Mediterranean, uh, the Mediterranean Sea to elsewhere, or maybe inside there. I don't know. A little uh, lighthouse action. <laughs> I don't know. I like I like this map too. Ready for battle. Interesting. See, I was gotta wait a bit to confirm what they've got. Okay, uh, looks like we're gonna see a kind of a divey uh, comp with the widow here. Um, two snipers lost their uh, lost their sombra, so you see Zed cut onto the onto the tank guy on Diva. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I uh, I think that makes I think that makes sense. Um, yeah. yeah, dual snipers, little 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 dive comp, a lot of. Uh, a bubble heals the Toki Bear on the Mercy, and, uh, and then the long range heals the Rebel Rose over on the Zenyatta. I like it. Yeah, it's like a very similar kind of comp on the other team as well. Um, and on that, uh, Ash, and then, uh, what goes on, uh, Genji, so a little bit divey. Ooh, we're seeing Nami getting super pressured though. Ah, uh, there you go. Does get back, does get back. The rest of the team gets those up. And UFO actually answers her pursuer in kind. Logan getting deleted down with nice headshot. Sand taking up everywhere. We see these two dive tanks kind of coming on down the bottom of this uh, little tower here. Pressure on the sound as UFO continues her work up top. Well done. Just sitting up top this uh, globe? Radar? What are we looking at here? Yeah, just, uh, uh, I don't know what that thing's supposed to be, you know, just not to make much sense. The, th the thing on top is, like, spinning, so I'm, I'm assuming it's, you know, like, on ships and stuff. And that's that's not how spin. radar works, but we'll, we'll see what's going Um, okay, whatever that antenna thing is, all the way up the top. It's getting, like, a much better angle, with all that extra height. Yeah. Well, she got, like, a little bit of cover behind it, too. Oof, she didn't even need the cover. She's behind heads already. Yeah, it's enough. It's enough. Uh, it's enough of an angle to you pick on that stuff right now. Ooh, both of these tanks to the side of Stormbreakers just getting punished up top. From the fall. Oh, Zach had tossing down bottom. It's yeah, she's gonna have that remake here soon. That was mostly just oh. Rebel Rose. <laughs> Rebel Rose saw UFO getting the headshot. Oh my. Zan getting a getting a headshot of her own, continuing on with the ash. I would say Rebel Rose saw uh, you know saw her teammates getting headshots and got jealous. Yeah, you saw that Kayla got a little bit a little bit of a uh, kind of catching the action happening, but they not today Lego. Zadka and company take that one, that old thing Genji down. Toki Bear pulling hers Mercy Ultimate. Perfect timing there. Rebel trying to create some space for the ultimate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Rod Rod up in the front here. Ooh, that was just some great coordination. By this, uh, a little by bit too backers. close to the front there now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Feeling the fire, hundred um, percent. Yeah, that, yeah, that, that attacking team. That's that's all I can say about that one. All the all, all the constant. Very, very nice. Very uh, very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very so Nami does get those dragons eaten. Rain Monkey playing that diva to that maximum potential. So Do Rod Rod is saying, yeah, there you go. Forcing out the trains is exactly what these tanks want to do. That didn't change to take down here soon. But to Rod Rod's super low and Bob takes him on out. That, oh, this went to Substruct. Oh, Ooh. two, both support. Zadka continuing on the theme with multiple diva kills. Against supports, that, that's just their way of life. I think that was just supposed to be a rematch. Like, oh, they, they, were just, I, they were behind, they wanted a rematch, so they could contest yeah. Kayla. I don't think they were trying yeah. to get anybody. I, I, I'm not a represent sure. She, she's gotten... I, well, yeah, she got 3Ks and, you know, and managed to get a Torp turret in there on last match. I, I wouldn't be surprised if it was 
Cool, calm, cold, and calculated. Dude, it looks like they're gonna get the first point anyway. Ah, man, I should have paid attention to what the, what the ticker went up to to actually remember how much, how much time they get. I think it's a minute 20 or a minute 30 a minute. Um, uh, I don't know. It's extra time. Uh, like Iris said, enough time to be annoying. So now, dive kind of coming on top here. Both teams fighting. Lego gets that one out. Dragons down bottom. Sectioning off, but uh, Rod Rod with that Winston ult is going to have a lot of it. Xan falling in the back as Cloud in the Sky turns on the Battle Mercy yet again. Don't keep getting nice and stuff here. And Xan's going to get runs. We're going to see a full offensive team coming in this one. Self-destruct on board as Rebel Rose does fall. No transcendence to be had. And they just stroll on in. Easy street. Yeah. Not, not so much of that defense, but point. Uh, now. Getting a little bit staggered back. Hmm. Need a bit of a chance to regroup. So maybe their big answers were the... Uh, the Reaper and Sombra. Yeah. I mean, you know, this is a payload map. You know, we, I mean, K, uh, King's Road was a little bit of that. But, uh, but you know, just interesting stuff. Interesting stuff. So Raidimus getting deleted down there. That was that, that, that uh, dynamite blew up right under the feet and uh, headshots on top. Not gonna bode well. Dragon's coming on out here. Oh, that Mercy almost gets. It's inside of it. Oh! oh. Clouded sky. I'm oh, sorry. Rebel Rose threading the needle on those Zenyatta shots. Finding your target. Bleating on down. Well done. Lego also down. Defense finding their first major hold of the game. Well done, ladies. Well, they Or, yeah, well, on the, on the, on the bottom part. Yeah, yeah, good point. So I, I, guess, it, I guess it was just super brawly there. Uh, they just kind of been rolling sins. Which is a good point. They have what, uh, what, one, two, they're going up against five? Almost six? Five, almost six. They got a transcendent. They can use that, right? Ooh, dragons down bottom. Raidimus does get taken out by that one. Rebel Rose and the rest are coming around, um, <clears throat> excuse me, to set on a point. Yeah, Broad Broad, oh, doing what she needs to, sitting up front with Queen Galaxy with some nasty headshots. Toki Bear with nasty roses again. Well done. So, this isn't got in the back of the- Oh, there you go, Queen Galaxy gets found out. Yeah, there you go. So, to broad, broad, uh, you know, Token personally getting, uh, getting killed in the last times out of Zinyana. Dragon takes out Mercy. That, nice placement on that. Yeah, so Rebel Rose has been getting these Discord orbs exactly with like, consistently. Uh, I feel like having some kills up on the top right. Uh, you know, have that Zenyatta right in front, right on the left. So they have both support ultimates on board. We've seen uh, Stormbreakers actually drop for, uh, two of them in this fast fight. Ooh, Lego, that, that's, that might be what they need to start this. Yeah. You can see they're expecting the other team. They're giving them space now with it. That's an awesome thing. They can manage the cover. They push it back around the corners. Dragon's down, but Transcendence answered. Nami does fall beforehand. De Broad taken down. Even almost the Max was able to get their own. Playing uh, around the corner, playing hide and seek. Yeah, Lego. yeah. Uh, Ring around the rosy. Zadka, that one though. 35 second offense is rolling in. Rubble Rose kind of off the side here, but they do have the windstorm plan. They do have the Mercy. Oh, oh wait. They're not able to get away from it. Yeah, just in the doorway, not quite. Now it's quite behind cover. Rain Monkey just getting deleted down. There's oh, the dragons. The dragons. Oof. Well, good rotation there. Just a couple meters just left. Spells, you know, the difference between safety and death doom. Delirious destruction. So that dash broad falling here. Zatka is down to that baby diva. Raidimus is getting so low. It does have the mercy. Is gonna be enough? Yeah. Charge coming in. And UFO taken. Or do you have to over out there. We have Zatka though. It's all in a way. Broad Broad back. Again, stalling away. Nami does fall pretty quickly though. Three meters, two meters. I don't think it's gonna be there. Nah. No, nobody. The owners. Can, it's pretty hard to turn a fight at that point without all advantage. Yeah, the, the uh the spawn doors here are definitely 
a lot farther away from others, you know, than, than other ones. You know, it's because, well, I mean, you know, just because it's, you have to go down the long hallway and then back, you know, it's like, you know, it's like a little zigzag, right? A surface area. Yeah, maybe maybe held that bottle a little, a little bit, a little bit long. Um, I I, even, know, I actually I, I, I don't know. So I don't I, I don't I didn't quite see. What yeah, that, that's what I was gonna say. I, I don't know how long she may have held it. Um, but uh, uh, yeah, uh, Bob, you know, if she had it five seconds earlier, placed maybe somewhere uh, where 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 Bob ended his you know his charge on like a vertical position, like maybe on those those uh, stacks of uh, you know a uh, 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 circular pipe or whatever down there. Maybe uh, I mean. He, he hits all of his shots, right? Like, they're, 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 they're turrets. They're yeah, they're, they're, they're... Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's a, it, he's got a thousand health. It's a... I mean, good positioning on a good bomb, you know, with a lot of health is just not a good day for a post team. Well, especially without, like, a Ryan to kind of give you a, a huge shield to cover against that bomb. Um, yeah, um, I mean, then just, you have a bobble once and have a closing team on the other, you have to make a decision at that point, right? Like, instant guaranteed hit scan shots from a bob, or, you know, damage from all the other team. Yeah, it really comes yeah. down to, uh, I, I guess kind of positioning, if you can get a, a wall on your back, you know? Yeah, speaking of positioning, the, uh, defenders have by the bridge here. So I really yeah, do like... Them out for your Gives them yeah, some yeah, free yeah. Uh, yep, so you go up right. They have a, a Bastion and a Rissa going all out. We haven't seen these come out since now. Yeah, like a little, uh, little, uh, little pirate ship, I believe. This one's called a little damage boosted Bastion. Zadka is going to get taken out by Max, so this isn't without loss on this one for the offender so far. But they're making some great time about around the last elbow of 3 minutes 20 seconds. Yeah, both their supports are stuck in a room away from their team. Oh, but they're able to take out Rod Rod. Cloud Sky trying to get in there on the res. Point. Right. Okay. Some oh. incredible time. Yeah, seriously. So, UFO on that Bastion has shown what the. Yeah, uh, the, 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 just shown a lot of promise, honestly. Zan does get a nice headshot there, but UFO and in kind taking Zan out. This offending team has close spawn, is rolling in five minutes plus on the board, Iris. Wow, this is, I mean, this is what you need. They've got three, uh, well, actually, no, they got two points, sorry. Um, but no time, so if they can, if they can get that time again, you know, by doing something like a Bastion and Eraser, that's, uh, gonna be enough. But now they know what they're up against, they have uh, quite a bit of a chance to respond to that, though. Yeah, and uh, UFO gets the, the dragons on, has to post self-destruct! Oh, self-destruct's gonna uh, take out the opposing uh, baby diva, so this might be it. Zan just shooting away there in the middle. Rez coming in for Nami, answering with a transcendence. That's a great answer, and drawing the shots too. Rebel Rose taking it all for the team while she is invincible. Coming on back here, and that's... Wow, it just comes out of it. It's just the perfect... Yeah. And you saw how uh, because they're kind of bullying the rest of the team. Kind of trying to tank you know, out of the way saw... so that their team can kind of focus on the bottom and focus on the ass. Yeah, Zach was kind of doing damage over the side, but Zan, like you said, was kind of bowling up to the front. They really want this UFO team to, or the UFO Bastion, you know, get, get back on point and maintain that position. Yeah, they really depend, they really depend on kind of trying to get rid of those tanks uh, that have the kind of ultimates and positions kind of behind them and take a stand to Bastion. Because Bastion's all of those, and Team Activa, he's a Take him out! Oh, out! Zan next! Might be 12 o'clock! It is for a cloud and sky, but Nami is not gonna live long for those transgressions. Oh, That's a big shatter! UFO taking out first, and Radimus is swinging away. Rod Rod getting taken super low, but with that fortify up, and now that res onto UFO, they're gonna be in a great position. As I say that though, big Zen burst onto this. Uh, UFO Bastion again. You got the transcendent so canceling out Bob's damage there. He's gonna give enough damage to Bob. He's shield in front of him. He's Bob can't do something. <laughs> Not enough to defend Bob and the rest of the team. 
Yeah, uh, yeah. Zan's buff is well placed there, but with answering the trans the trans uh, uh, sentence, yeah, there really isn't a whole lot of top can do. Yeah, that's where the rest of the team comes in. So you have been switching on over to the main. Uh, I can see it happening, especially for these, you know, these last like few elbows. Maybe an open point. Maybe wouldn't so much. But the, the point is to get ready to miss this. Though. Yeah, you know, that's not a lot of damage though. Just, you know, just the uh, strong damage from the three. The maze damage is great if you get the headshot. Yeah, the Broadbar getting a, a charge on the, her opposing Reinhardt is going to be a great way to start this one. A broken shield is not there. There's another charge! Oh, almost gets the Zenyatta Queen Galaxy is so low! Oh my god! So we see this May stalling now down here. Now forcing, uh, after a couple of picks, uh, Mjolnir's to come on back. He's actually deleted. Um, oh, and a Bob. You know, the Bob. Bob may a bit here. Yeah, Bob was hungry. Bob wants some kills. Not gonna have that Bob for next time. Yeah, the Queen Galaxy already up to that, uh, almost one of transcendence. That's, that, that's just some wild amount of healing in the end. I like they're trying to kind of stall him out, just kind of force him. Not gonna get any picks. Zyka, yeah, pressuring up as Anne forced on down. Zyka's gonna have a lot of damage on top between a lot of these. I mean, just long range, you know, long range damage. We have, we have Anna, McCree, and May. So they've got, they got a couple things to worry about, though. Reyna is ultimate ready. Uh, Reyna is ultimate ready, and so can get uh, some of the transcendent, so. Oh. Reyna is gonna get slept and frozen and killed. Because the pods are protected. Oh, yeah, the broad brought in like literally the entire uh, Manolner's team takes out the opposing Reinhardt. Uh, Diva met or Diva Subtra coming out isn't gonna really get do too much there. Rain Monkey deleted down for to we'll get back into that bed. Now we see a tracer. Lego's trying to find it. Push them off the charge so they could oh. have it. Oh, Raidemus was trying to get that charge down. Broad Rod taking them out. Not today, my friend. That thing. Hmm, so Queen Galaxy looks like gets the bad spawn? Uh, Queen Galaxy. Yeah, it looked like she got the bad spawn, that's why she got taken a little bit or a little bit late. Um, not really anything against her, obviously. Huge big shatter, big shatter! Swing away on Raidimus again! There's the big swollen Reinhardt, though, she's swinging away. Raidimus. Side that's not frozen. Oh no, the Nana Boost comes off! Get back. Oh, no. And Raidem is... Oh, there you go. You don't know getting taken out of that one. Yeah. Raidemus is really getting left out in the cold there, right? Yeah, indeed. Hmm. So Nami fallen here. Uh, both of these teams kind of showing a preference for this little, uh, this little ruin here where the big one is. But Raidemus is anti yeah, so we see Broad Broad, uh, you know, getting through that one after a nasty anti Frozen Lego! Oh my gosh, Broad Broad taken out by Queen Galaxy. Again, uh, yeah, he's charging up Zen shots, right? Yeah, this is a lot. Bob is not a threat, though, for that man on this yeah, the, well, the main can freeze, the main can wall off. There's the main freeze, in fact, the big blizzard. Dragon's coming out to section these teams away, but all oh, the anti grenade ensures that Raidimus will lead it down from that one. But they go fall. Yeah, that was not, not able to take the corner on that one, get away from that self destruct. Iris, this team is fighting half down, might be 12 o'clock! Oh my gosh, this is entirely UFO. Get a number of kills here. Oh, I guess this working off from spawn, but here comes the hammer to try to stall it out. Get a different rate in this. Hello, Nate. Alex is purple. Raidimus is damage down. Rebel Rose is basically behind the other team. Alex is out. This defense is answering. Offense only took it in, in overtime. Frozen. Offense is doing quite a bit. The truck coming down. Oh, it's oh, made just a perfect time. Charge coming into Rain Monkey. That team is going to be a okay in this one. Here comes that Earth Shatter. There's the Shatter. There's the Freeze. Both of these ultimates fighting it out. Out. It looks like Mjolnir's going to take it. Oh, and they're frozen in there. Overtime. Well done. And we go on to the third round. 
like it. I like it. A little overtime matches here, Iris. Yeah, this is uh, exciting. I think we've kind of seen the effects of how you know these uh, these hero bands have uh, you know that, that have taken effect, right? Yeah, you know it. It feels you know I kind of like it. I have to say, I kind of like it. Like yeah, I'm, I'm not it against. Like they've, they've, there's always been there's kind of been you know the first match with no bands was kind of you know testing the waters and you kind of so, but then you kind of see people kind of get forced into something that's a little bit more a little bit more diverse. Well, we've seen, um, yeah, Nami, I believe, was playing over on, uh, no, hang on, no, Zach has been on, on the D.Va, but Nami was the one, did, did Nami play, saw, uh, like, off-tank as well? Um, maybe, I, I can't remember who was doing it when Dick. Hmm. I, I think we've seen a change by, um, by one, by one of these, uh, by one of these players, you know, on from, you know, what they were playing on the next after... The hero changes came in, and I do have to wonder if that was like, oh well, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, you know, better on this one, but you know, you're better on Divas, so now I'll go support or, or whatever else. And it's just, uh, I mean, it's just an interesting dynamic, dynamic, I guess. Indeed. So again, those uh, hero bands for me owners, Reaper and Sombra, cannot be played. Stormbreakers are on the right. Widowmaker and Reaper cannot be played. So so far, we have seen only. Offensive heroes being, or, or D, uh, DPS heroes, I guess after the after the change, I guess I should say, uh, be banned so far. Yeah, we haven't had any sports get banned. We haven't had any banned. No um, tanks, no sports. Interesting stuff. Yeah, well, I mean, it feels like the DPS is always maybe the most oppressive thing. So if you can kind of push them on the people. Yeah. Uh, so so far. Them to falter. Um, yeah. But I mean, if you if you ban you know Moirana. Yeah, we were talking about that a little bit before, like, you know, what happens, you know, to uh, two main supports, like, force them into, you know, just the inner, just the mercy. You see a Junkrat come out here, you got a Far Mercy and a Thin. Yeah, Far Mercy going up against them, uh, honestly, I mean, obviously, just with the Junkrat down bottom, I see this Far Mercy working better, right? Yeah, they don't, they don't have a lot to respond to that with. Um, you know, Nami with the, you know, Nami with the Hanzo, Rebel Rose, if she's able to get those shots up top, but with the damage boosted Mercy, it's gonna be a tough ticket to fill. Yeah, you know, Ana, Ana can do a lot, and Hanzo can do a lot, but that's a, it's not, it's definitely not uh, an answer that I would go. Mm, and of course, they're just trying to get as much distance as they can with this time. Yeah, with five seconds left, we're about to hit overtime field though. UFO over in the back left, trying to get this damage down. Oh, Raiden is taken down with a nasty charge. That's the nice main tank the offense, but now, tire. Yep, Tire's looking for it. Points a little bit. Maybe they're going to be able to stall him here. Dragons as well. I think this might be the yep. end. Oh man. So 37.77 meters. Uh, the broad broad, I keep saying diamond, I'm not sure why. Broad broad uh, has the shatter in the end just for style points. Really. 37.75 <laughs> meters, excuse me. Yeah, can we award it on style points? Is that, is that style points, style points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like you show them they had it, right? Yeah. Um, and well, I'll just say broad broad. The broad broad is just, is just messing my mind up. <laughs> uh, at least he didn't spend an entire game randomly calling them broad man. Broadband. That would be well. Yeah, I, I can. Uh, I can definitely say that. I'm glad that I didn't do that. Uh, are you speaking from you know personal experience here, Iris? You know, I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. Oh, okay. I'm sure you'd never do that. I, I'm, of course not. <laughs> word, word. Uh, yeah. Some some player names obviously being uh, you know being a little a little, little little wonkier to say. All these are you know just awesome answers. I can't can't, uh, can't say enough for it. Yeah, looks um, like we're maybe gonna have two far mercies depending on the course we could switch up for that. Uh, hmm. What they're on right now is uh, both teams are on far mercy. Well, yeah, and Farah always, you know, at least in the discussion for bands, because you know, the, it, she is the only character that can suspend herself in air for any, you know, for any like substantial amount of time, right? Like, yeah, you can jump, play. but but yeah, and, yeah, exactly. You know, we, in the Overwatch League, we never see these guys staying touched, right? Of course. 
Oh, we can see you do a follow though, having a fight with Lego. Ooh, yeah, Raiden is getting like a little far down here. Dark Broad Broad taken oh, out in the back again. A little freeze, a little discord, a little diva damage. Is That's gonna purple, though. They can do damage. Oh! Damage down. There's the dive in! Lego taken out by her counterpart. UFO and team are rolling. UFO follows it up with a of the opposing support. Yeah, Nance built up a shield there, or a, a wall there, but that might have actually helped the uh, attackers because they didn't have to deal with as much defense as uh, And yeah, there they are. Yeah, the owner is taking this one, going up 2 2 1 in this best of five. They need one more to take it all the way. So You're we're going to take it to. Uh... No, no, here, here. Okay, right here. So far, give me your MVP, Iris. Is that a fair question? Um, I mean, I don't feel like it's a fair question, but I, I, I honestly, I give it to Zaka. I really like to see. I really liked uh, when they were on the that Sombra. Yeah, yeah. That was that was they did so much work on the Sombra. Um, it's, it, it's between Zaka and UFO for me. Yeah, y UFO. Yeah. Uh, I was gonna say between UFO, Queen Galaxy has been popping off. But Xan, uh, you know, has to be shouted out again, or not again, sorry, for, uh, you know, played with it earlier, now on the main, and found a lot of value in it. You know, the flexing, there's a lot to be said there. There's a lot to be said there. Yeah, We're you know, that main, it was really, it was really uh, an interesting switch, and it worked out quite well for them. Those big freezes, and, uh, you know, just kind of pushing them back a bit. Yeah, uh, I mean, what, 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 we, we saw the May all over the opposing Reinhardts, like, consistently, right? Um... There's an entire nano boost in the second point uh, that, or, or you know, going into the last point, excuse me, that you know the Reinhardt got the got the nano boost and spent like all five or seven seconds frozen. Yeah, <laughs> kind of as they were retreating as well. Yeah, and, <laughs> and I mean, forced them to kind of. Yeah, and you don't have to do the damage on if you just keep them frozen the whole time and then wall them off in the end to be able to you know t take them out a little bit easier. Once, you know, once the nano boost is off, once that 50% damage reduction is gone, you know, I mean, it's just a different answers that I think might be forced out a little bit by this interesting hero ban conception. Yeah, yeah banning def definitely is kind of forcing out maybe a little bit more interesting play, kind of unusual counters that you might not think of. Yeah, you know, maybe, you, know, you want to disable a Reinhardt, maybe, but, you know, if you don't have a Sombra, what you, could you do? Maybe you could go May. Yeah, and they found the value in it. So, these teams going to vote on their this round's hero bands. Being the winners, Mjolnir's will pick the next map, and we'll get that to you guys in just a minute. Don't tune away. We'll be back with you in just a minute. Wait, on Mercy Band. From, from um... All right, folks, 
This is it. This is the day. Jeff Kaplan said he was tired of all you complaining about her, all the reworks and everything. This is it. Mercy's done. Yeah, we've given her the ultimate rework. Uh, Milner's can no longer use Mercy. No Mercy, no Widow, no Sombra, no Reaper. That yeah, is for both team teams have Widow and a, uh, so or a Reaper ban. Mm -hmm. but, yeah, but only Mjolnir's can also not play uh, Sombra and Mercy, as they are the 2-1 winners so far in this best of five. Head on over here to Eichenwald, where we only will see reses coming out from one team. Well, if they decide to play Mercy, you never know. Yeah, uh, so, sorry, so only one team will be able to res anybody. Uh, we were talking a bit in the pre-chat about how that might really, uh, you know, affect this upcoming match. Yeah, you know, that that, that res is, is a really good um, counter to kind of port placement or, you know, kind of just silly little mistakes. Anything. You know, gets you that ult back in the game. Yeah. You know, one team yeah. can't do that. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, it, it is kind of an answer for anything, right? Like, I bad mean, placement, uh, a nasty depends. headshot, like not getting behind a Ryan shield. Like yeah, well, I mean, it depends, because it's not an answer for jumping into the other team and getting killed. So, you know, you, you, if, you're, if your Winston jumps in and they're, and they're you know, destroyed, you're not going to likely be resing them unless you're spending a lot of energy on that. Okay, fine. Be logical, Iris, whatever. I'm just complaining about res, all right? Just let me have my moments. <laughs> I mean, uh, on, on a very real note, I've said for a long time, Res, Ooh, I don't think Res really has a place to overwatch, but like, uh, that is a very, very good point. That in it, its present form, it is much, much more balanced, and, and, and you know, that is, it is, it is useless in certain. Although sometimes you still, you still get annoyed when you, you know, you can't do that damage fast enough, or you don't have the ability to push her away. Yeah. Well, again, I'm a Lucio main. You can't res boobs. Sorry, sorry about you. Sorry about your feelings. Yeah. So. Uh, Lego and Radom is finding two early picks here against the defense. Um, oh, little char charge for charge, swinging away, getting a lot of actual damage down uh, on, on Radom as before she falls there. Three minutes, 20 seconds. Um, yeah, there you go. Now there's that offense pushing over the point. These uh, Symmetra turrets almost taking Zane out, though. <laughs> a little bit of an unlucky, uh, Ooh. A bit Ooh. UFO getting a good... <laughs> Wow, that, that was the final movement. Yeah, like Zane was just really trying her best to get away from these turrets, and in the end, it was all for naught. Speaking of un of uh, reses for kind of four times to die, Lego gets back. Yeah, so, so yeah, we see uh, we see with the first res, this one coming on here for uh, Stormbreakers, we're able to play that one. Um, I think that's going to continue to have to continue to make a difference, Cyrus. Well, I mean, yeah, yeah essentially get an extra uh, life in one of your fights so you know if you can find that res if you can get if you know if the other two if you're if you you know clever enough maybe you could deny them all the resin but that's pretty unlikely well rebel rose the way she's been playing zenyatta nami on the on the, they've been really just getting like long range picks a lot and those uh, that is I don't know, like what we were just saying that what res are for so lego yeah back in the back by uh, falling there actually to zadka i believe they am finding one of her own against Rebel. Oh, that shatter was blocked off, it looked like. There's a shield and a dragon. Dragon plays a very nicely with on you. Yeah, they called a coat of arms or something, right? Shield and a dragon, throw like an axe in there. Yeah, yeah, he's a like, yeah. sword, so a bow, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Zach, oh, actually kind of a little Bob's bit gonna push the oh, payload a little bit further, but... There you go, you love to see it, you love to see it. He's, he's still contesting. He's still he's pushing. Still pushing he's still pushing. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. Zan, uh, yeah, Zan's Bob getting an extra, you know, couple meters and out of that. And now they have the pressure and they need up front. Yeah, Rod Bob getting taken out. Self destruct over the top. That's good positioning. Oh, Clouded Sky feeling the fire. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, uh, so Symmetric deleted down for the defense, Nami on that as well, Rebel Rose also down, Zan's popping off, but ended the reign of terror here by Toki Bear. We see these two tanks just swinging away onto Zadka, answering in kind. But now this Rhina's back, shattered down, that's only gonna get clouded again! 
Oh, but the there's the barrage! Oh, yeah, that's a, that, that's, that was a very well time. Getting a mech and a Reinhardt, that's worth all day. Can you see that? Why is him on the box? Coming out across this bridge here, they they only have one person. They don't need they don't need much more though. They're uh, probably about eight meters away. Oh, as Rebel Rose falls, well timed sound bear. Queen Galaxy just saving Keen in a great way. Sub, bro, bro. There's Watch the shatter to answer it. Oh, Bob pushed off by the blast from the mech. Oh no, he can't. He can't survive the ledge. Oh my god. Bob is our hero. Bob is our cast hero. Bob's our mascot. That's beautiful. Bob is not fall. Bob, Bob is pushing payloads. Bob's getting kills. Bob's not getting booped. I love it. Let's go. Oh, Three minutes 45 here as the Stormbreaker is pushing on in. Uh, this Arista shield getting deleted down very quickly. Comes the dragon from the attacking team. Answered instantly by the transcendence. Rebel Rose again with the, with the awareness. I like it. So lots of damage coming now on to. No, right, Rainbow Dude. Yeah, nothing. You gotta shatter though. There's nothing they can do against that. Yeah, no shield. There it comes. It's actually getting very low. Rainbow was down, but the res, they couldn't do anything out of it. They had to get out of there. Yeah, Raidimus is actually finding two with Fire Strike. You don't see that one. Comes another Bob. Yeah, another Bob. Yeah, Zayas right behind them, they're split, just like we talked about earlier. Very, very good position for that Bob so far. Still shooting on it and is locked on there, but now gone. Defense is back. Raidimus in the front, swinging away. Gets away from the heels, doesn't get that up. That um, supercharger is not uh, going to be enough, uh, enough damage for that. Self destruct. Does have the corner is gonna take out Zan. Defense kind of turning around here, pushing him back a little further. Like it's gonna take out your photo. You have a tracer. Is that switch over? Yeah. So, um, yeah, he's all the way up to uh, Dalton. All those too. I did not see that either. Well, the tracer builds her all pretty fast, so. Very true. Very true. So, Lego and company are gonna have four, almost five ultimates on board, looking at one close to three to the side of the orders. Um, Random is now down here as Zadka is over the back, Dragon sectioning away though. Big charge does take out Queen Galaxy. Good uh, aim with that one as a coalescence does drop, but Rez gets Queen Galaxy up, and we're gonna see a full Stormbreaker's team as this oh, is all get shattered. Oh, yeah, they, they have a it's sound bomb. here too. They, they uh, invested the D.Va ult as well to make sure oh, you got, you got an ult. Oh, on Lego there. Yeah, UFO again with the aim. Well done. Dragon's coming on to section point. That's actually keeping this defense alive for a while. Now, D.Va, there, Nana Boo's coming on to baby D.Va. That can now, able using that to get back into mech here, install for a little while longer. Out of her mech gun already. They're doing everything they can. They just got... One or two ults, they can get Broadbrod up there and get a nice shatter, and that's all they can hope for. He has it, or she has oh, it. Oh no! Down. Really, we're coming on. Get out. Dragons now as well, but Eden Zadka with the awareness shatter down as well. Yeah, it looks like Stormbreaker is gonna be able to put this this one on him. Oh, what a cut! Yeah. Broad Broad had a good shatter there at the end, but uh, I just yeah, an, another level. another second another second might have been a different story. Yeah, and bomb was also right right about to happen, but taken out too early. So he's bomb. That that mm -hmm. So Stormbreakers taking this one all the way in with time on the bank. So we have 42 seconds for them. If Mjolnir is able to push this all the way in with time. Or with less than a minute, then both teams will get a minute. If it's with more time, then Mjolnir's will be on defense. Stormbreakers will have their minute to push, and uh, and we'll see from there, right? Yeah.
What are we gonna see here? We're gonna see here. Pharmacy combination possible for the Stormbreakers. Not what they're showing, but you know. Yeah, yeah, uh, that's something I didn't really mention. You know, with Mercy out of the picture, you can't run Pharmacy. Yeah. I mean, and, and I mean, it is so hard to keep Ferris up without a Mercy, right? I mean, a Zen Orb up top is is good, but it's it, it's almost like you want to be able to keep that Zenyatta, you know, long range healing for you know other situations, right? Yeah, you know, there, there's there's very few other you know Ana can get the range, but if but Faro is you know frequently behind the wall, so. You know, yeah. Playing very carefully around that. Yeah. Uh, and, and I mean, Anna, I guess can get her nade down bottom shots up top. It's just that, that, well, unless he's lost her nade though, and that's yeah, yeah. And, and it just it requires like a lot more. Oh, here we go. We see a little edited guy come coming on out here. Oh, they're all purple though. That might be a big advantage for them. Yeah, Cloud's guy getting a big one off the rip, but that hook. Oh, the guy's guy getting very low here on the Anna. Double Rose is going to feel the fire at the first, though. 3 minutes, 30 seconds. It looks like this attack, uh... Yeah, they might manage to get back, get back to, uh, together a little bit more. Nami over on the Roadhog. That's, 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 uh... Yeah, already up to 65% ultimate. 70% of ultimate. She's yeah, been hit once already. Oh, right. I'm sorry? First time I've seen Roadhog, uh, play this, uh... Yeah, but, but, and it hooks already, you know? Oh, there it is! Ray to miss Lego is both, and no uh, turret as well. Here it comes. I believe that's a nano boost down. Yeah, they're using those to Bob. Bob's pushed the A off the point, still. Down! There's the Shatter Queen Galaxy is there! Deleted oh, Yeah, Broadway's looking for that target and found it. Self destruct is gonna take out Zadka here. Now on over to that. Uh, Lucio dropping sound beers left and right as the self destruct does find Lego. Raiden is falling immediately afterwards. This Toppins does have one tick, and with that, they will be getting very close to two. They need to stay away from that. Uh... Okay, I was gonna say they seem to stay away from that uh, Torb ultimate, but they're using it for their advantage, for their uh, their, their their healers to get the ultimate. Smart idea. Yeah, you know, uh, it looks like Xanthan is on to Bastion. Defensive Bastion here. Yeah. Defensive Bastion to take on Goat's Comp, not, uh, I'm not against it at all. Diva Reinhardt right up top, and put a turret right next to him, and then another, um, oh no. Yeah, the Anna, usually it's worse. Yeah, it's an interesting, it's an interesting. It's interesting, but it's what we need to see. Oh, Zach is starting this one off with a boop. Dan behind in the middle of the team getting oh. smashed apart by the, what on yeah. earth? Um, I, I think Xan might have, uh, might have missed, was trying to set up and just miss the ledge. Um, I mean, the Bastion to counter Ghost is... I mean, it's just a good, it's a good, it's a good way to go. And Ami trying to find one over the side. There's a big shatter, big shatter! They're gonna take advantage of that one all day long. Is Toki Bear, Broad Broad, UFO, Nami, all fighting picks their own. This is a kill but they here. They're all gonna get cleaned up. You know, one of the yeah. things about the Bastion against Ghost is that, some, is that it really, it, it, it isn't enough on its own. You really need to still structure around that Bastion and get that setup done. Ghost yeah. is just so strong against it still. Especially with yeah. the Hog in there. Well, just uh, so many sources Hog of healing to you, right? Well, and Hog can hook Bastion out of, out of the, uh... Yeah, there's like, there's like a specifically anti-Bastion Ghost comp. Like, no, no, yeah. sorry, uh, you know, just use the, just use the Bastion. But I mean, look at this, they have one, two, three, close to four, almost five ultimates on board, I reckon. Four yeah, and, and a half minutes. And look how much time they have to, to cap this yeah. final couple of uh, meters. Final, you know, 20 meters. Dragons first! Oh, but here come the bomb! The oh, Toki no. Bear is gonna get taken out. Scatter bomb combination. The broad bot is gonna be the next on the board to fall. Lego taking out a couple of her own. That's gonna spell a reset for this offensive team. Oh, they're gonna love Diva stagger a little bit there. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. <laughs> oh no, is that Zan, yeah, setting up in a different side, finds a nasty one against Sadka. And uh, again, no mercy on board, no reses. Oof, Zan barely getting away from that hook. Yeah, very, very narrow. 
There's a one hook to though. Dodge it, though. Oh, Nami. Pull, you know, pulls the hook in, tries the big, the, uh, the, the whole hog afterwards and gets the lead and down. Now we're pulling that Zan, uh, what is this, uh, what is the Bastion called? What? Uh, Bastion called? It's, uh, I believe it's called Tank configuration. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there's the other Shatter, the Captain Shatter against this Mjolnir team. Rod Rod down, that kid following afterwards, headshots all around. Maybe they're able to get some yeah, damage yeah. on the Ravens, though. Ravens going down. Still low. Ravens taking out. Yeah, this. Ghost Comp is right back there after this UFO mission now on over from the Diva on over to the Zarya. Dragon's still. Yeah, Dragon's. Not down here, but that's just a little bit off. Switch on the Zarya already has grab. Uh, trying to maybe do some, some work against that Bastion. Try to. Oh, yeah. Bastion's super low. This team is here. Dra yeah, Paul coming on in. Right doing her part. Yeah, just really maintaining on here. Zach, get oh, that might not be good. Oh, two supports taken out in that team fight. Yeah, never know. Have to pull back. Really you know, not quite, not quite as much time advantage now. Lost for the yeah, it's the so big number. Both teams very close to. To a number of vaults, Lego very close to uh, Dragon, Van very close to Tank configuration, and all. Um, I see an Ana all here too, and a Rhino all. And there's a uh, Transcendence, so both support all coming out. Early barrage, there's the crap down bottom, Xan falling. And that Dragon, I get down, yeah. Sectioning away, but that Shatter is gonna find a whole, whole lot here. Now, Rebel Rose Rally. Is gonna keep this team armored rolling into this next oh team fight. That's oh, a purple, huge though. anti. That is the biggest anti of 2019 as Dan takes advantage of it, shooting now down bottom. Radimus a little bit out of position, does fall, but with this defensive post spawn, I think they're gonna be able to maintain this one, Iris. Yeah, you know the the Bastion is now really you know the, so close to the spawn, so close to. It will kind of get actually get that set up if we need it earlier. Mm -hmm. just, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, you said it best. Dan, Dan's that's all the way up there, very weird. yeah, aggressive. Like, I, I mean, he, they they can, with a bastion up there, especially with her getting picks against Zadka, like they did last team fight. It was just it makes a lot of sense, right? Even though that's like their main source of damage, but again, because you just said it, their spawn is so short. Zane will be back in two seconds. Right? Yeah, well, yeah. It makes sense. Yeah, I'm yeah, about it. I'm about it. Be, they'll, they'll be right. They'll be right there. And there's no, no real concern. Yeah, Rebel Rose kind of answering here over on the sun, but I think that, yeah, they're kind of be okay. Oh, Big shutter that, down, yeah. flying all around. Radimus does fall there immediately after Broad Broad. Hey Monkey and Lego also though. Zan to get a fall last. That's what they needed. Galaxy pulling that transcendence does have clouded sky there with, but they're both gonna fall soon. Those supports being up front, up front and uh, falling is not gonna be how this defense is to hold. That can narrowly avoid dying to <coughs> run. Oh, fire starting. Oh. Self destruct coming now down here. Isn't gonna get anything off there. Scopo does utilize that support to her advantage with the bubble right up in the front. Double Rose getting a pick off here. We're looking at overtime, Iris. Yeah, and they started out with you know, four minutes to take the last couple of meters. Now they're in overtime. The ultimate's now still coming out there. Broad Broad not able to... Spurs the shatter down. Looks like deep might be... Or, uh, sorry, offense might be... Holding it here as Rabble with another rally. They're able to push it in. Maintaining all the way through the finish line. Mjolnir's is taking them to overtime. I like it. Looks like Rob Rod needs to sub now. Uh, Alright, we might see a little uh, might see a little little pause action that'd be okay. Yep. To a broad broad playing the main tank, the little uh, crazy Ryan Winston. They'll be getting another one here in soon. This is, uh, yeah, this is two to one for Mjolnir, so we could be seeing the, uh, well, th this is going to be Stormbreakers on defense. And if Mjolnir pushes it farther, this could be the last round. Or if Stormbreakers wins, we could be seeing this round, another round, and then another match, and then after this.
of that if they take both. So we will be seeing. Uh, we'll be seeing. You know, th th this game is still entirely up in the air. Well, we'd see. Uh, yeah, we'd see uh, one more match if uh, Storm Pickers win. It was a best of five. Yeah. Yeah. So it's so. Uh, oh no, you're right. Because if they win this one, they get. Dude, I'm bad with math. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh well. At least, at least it's just two teams in best of five format. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that no, that makes sense. So just uh, still with math. You, you get these single numbers. You have them together. I just this this is too much for this caster here. I don't I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> um. So rebel or no? Sorry, that's uh that's broad broad leaving here. Um, it'll be interesting to see how that main tank, uh, you know, role is filled. Oh, are we seeing, oh, a little aiming action? Yeah, I think I'm gonna, uh, there's one pack to fill for them. Yeah, yeah, Bro Broad is, uh, heading out. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. So Omna's, uh, taking the place. Omna, excuse me. So do you know who Omna plays? Um, maybe. <laughs> is it a secret you can't tell me yet? No, it's just I'm surprised. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm just playing with you. Um, yeah, I, I would just be interested to see if no, you know, if if not support which of the sports might uh, might switch on over to uh, the main thing. Yeah. Be, be interesting. Amna's the Amna main. Amna is an Amna main. Now that's but, a mouthful. But we will see. We'll see if she ends up playing on it. Amna that's mains a... Amna. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. a that's a lot of M and N sounds there. Yes. Um, let's see. So. Uh, yeah, we have Amna and Nami in the same team. Dude, that's interesting. Lots of lots of similar names coming across here, Death Mmm, very many names. Yeah, and again, this is the uh, this is the one day one day ban hammer tournament put on by the Death Blossoms. An awesome league. If you guys haven't checked them out, you haven't followed the Twitch channel, follow them on Twitter. Honestly, I'm not sure what you're doing because they do stuff like this all the time. They're doing more tournaments on, um, in a couple weeks. And, and again, can't tell exactly what we're planning, but we're having some fun playing for some April Fool's stuff. Uh, there'll just be, you know, some good, clean Overwatch fun. Maybe even more games than Overwatch. I guess I didn't specify. Um, but at least some Overwatch fun. <laughs> Hopefully at least there's some Overwatch in <laughs> Alright, looks like we're going to pause here on the thumbnail. A little Eichenwald action. A little Eichenwald action. <laughs> Omna... The Ana main. We'll be seeing if this team rolls with triple support. No, they ran it just last time. I think that might be unlikely. I think, uh, yeah, I think we're gonna. Let's see. Yeah, I'm just gonna run uh, DPS. Okay, okay. A little 3 2 1 looks like. Oh no, that's 2 2 and 2. A little yeah, 2 yeah. 2 2, excuse me. Coming on out here from the offense so far, but I have uh, I've made the the mistake of uh, you know cast or, or calling uh, calling offensive team compositions before they before they start. Yeah, yeah. So I'll stick with defense here. Yeah. Defense showing the uh, hit scans. Dan, Cloud Sky over on the Anna, showing a lot of uh, showing a lot of value on that Five. so far. Rain was back on her Reinhardt. Rain Monkey on that Diva. And Gavs off supporting it up. Well, and Lego's on uh, May, which we haven't seen yet. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, but they do have quite. They do have that soldier. Yeah, they have the long range damage, they have the short range damage. Um, yeah, yeah. yeah, Queen Galaxy, Cloud Sky, Xan on long range. Lego and Zrain really mess them up at short, you know, medium range. Yeah, sure. Look at Lego there. There's the. Yep, Wall there it is. Army, but Lego, yes, yeah, sneaky, so sneaky. There's a little bit, it's not quite a perfect wall off there. Yeah, there's a little bit they're, of they're gonna, they're gonna not be able to turn that around though. But they're still pushing yeah. around the side here though. What, three, four kills now, Nami falling a little bit there. Yeah, Rebel Rose is gonna be a little bit later after that. Omna now switching on over to that ham and wrecking they ball. They gotta get there as fast as they can. Indeed a must. Rebel Rose switching on over to Lucio. Back to point UFO on the Ryan uh, Genji, excuse me, getting very low here. I'm not, not able to stall any longer, fulfilling that roll 100%. Oh, this Reinhardt out! Point, though. Oh, Nasty no, oh, shatter. 
Oh man, Reynolds getting that already. Less than a minute. That's some nutty stuff. Do you think you can get there, that? No, not quite yet. No, oh. so that's uh, yeah, that's gonna be Mjolnir's uh, only potentially tying this, right? I guess we could go to another overtime. Uh, no, they, yeah, they're tying. Huh. Well, no, I mean, yeah, if it's tie, then 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 we'll do a I don't know control best of one or something. I don't know, we'll figure it out. This is the there's a potential for Stormbreakers to only win or tie. They have a minute forty two to take one tip. And uh, they have a wider hero pool too, right? Again, Stormbreakers can only not play Widowmaker and Reaper in this Van Hammer tournament. Mjolnir's, on the other hand, cannot play Reaper, Sombra, Widowmaker, or Mercy. Yeah, you know, they, they tried running on the... Without having any kind of Mercy that, against the pretty strong hit scan. It didn't work out for yeah, Zayn has been showing the prowess on those hit scans just all the all day today, right? Well, you um, know, and with the May, you know, primarily probably to wall them off and kind of kind of stall that first push and give them no time to kind of take take that. Um, the but the May also freezing them in place, giving you know Zayn a little bit more opening to get that damage in. And, you know, there they go. A hundred percent, a hundred percent. Um, and, and especially for I mean, like you just said, they only have a minute. The May right there, especially not engaging until absolutely necessary. They only needed a couple picks. You know, one minute is two fight territory maximum. One minute, 30 seconds, coming on in here for the Stormbreakers. Raymond's making the flag in a bit. So charge done. Raymond's going to fall first on this one. Offense going to be fighting without their main tank. Just fighting to get back. Cloud of Sky. Yeah, then kind of going back. Uh, there you go. I don't know, back. He's back already in. You know, they have a little bit more time. Maybe give themselves one or two. Yeah, and I mean, Cloud is down to 65, or, you know, sorry, 60% uh, Mercy Ultimate. That's going to be significant here. This is more yeah. Almost a tire, though, on the uh, defenders. Yeah, that's very true. If UFO gets this off, that's. Oh, that's a big boop there by Queen. Here comes the tire! And it takes out Radimus. Meanwhile, though, UFO and. There's the res. They're only gonna be down Lego. This team fighting five to six here. Of, or sorry, five to four here. Down out of the mech. Uh, my owner is just fighting back in a kind 27 seconds. Omno with the the attack visor though. This team fighting or hiding really just behind this entire mess of stuff back here. Omna now. Oh no. Omna not able to hold it herself. Looks like this Stormbreaker's team is taking it, going two to two. We are going to a map five, Iris. A map five. Or it always a match seems five. to go this way. It always seems to go this way. Hey, it's uh, I'm about a little drama, drama. You know, I'm about it. Indeed, indeed. Going down to the wire. I uh, I am super interested to see who they will ban. My guess is. Honestly, Lego on Hanzo, I can see that. Uh, the May, maybe? Maybe, maybe. Ash, I think, is on the chopping block, though. Ash is certainly on the chopping block. Um, but, you know, I mean, it's not so much a strong DPS um, at any particular hero that they're up against. They're just up against some strong DPS. Yeah, yeah, they're up against players who are good at flexing to other characters. Right, I mean that's all what Overwatch is about. Counterpicking, and I, I mean I guess if especially if this band theme becomes you know more popular in Overwatch, that's going to be their own you know that's going to be an own idea of counterpicking in and of itself, right? Indeed. So now checking out Discord chats here, we're going to do um we're going to figure out what uh, what heroes are banned. You know, again these casters. Uh, Predicting Ash, Hanzo, maybe, maybe some rain. We'll be back with you guys in just a second.
going to root 66. Initiating match. And we are back here with the Death Blossoms Ban Hammer One Day Tournament. Route 66, last match of the day. 2-2 two to two for this Team Stormbreakers, Team Mjolners, Team Mjolners in the blue, Team Stormbreakers in the red. I am FBI Tugboat. With me is Iris. Producer in a way, being the lovely, awesome person that she is. Deluxity, all in a way that I was being a producer making our jobs just so much easier. Always appreciate that. All right, and we see uh, another two bands. And that's going to be uh, Ash and Hanzo. Uh, the uh, Stormbreakers can no longer use them. I got the right, yeah. Yep. Um, yeah, yeah. So pretty much all of the main snipers banned on uh, Stormbreakers. Well, figured we'd see this eventually. Yeah, I, I, I can't help but feel like Zane's being... And being penned in, you know, closed off. Yeah. Widow, Hanzo, Ash... And the Reaper for Stormbreakers, and again, that is Reaper, Sombra, Widow, and Mercy for Mjolnir's. So a little bit of a, a little bit more spread out, right? A little, little close range damage with the Reaper. You know, Sombra is always wonky. Widowmaker banned, obviously, by, you know, the, the, the long range sniper. And then Mercy, you know, the only support band so far in this main hammer tournament. Attackers incoming. Yeah, we see both teams winning an Ana, and, uh,. We're gonna see the um, Milner's running a uh, Moira as well as an Ana. Two big main Dude. healers. Mm -hmm. The main supports. I, we've seen that a couple different times here. Um, I, I think they're just predicting very brawly feist off the rip. You know, like off the first little bit. Yeah, you know, and with, with, uh, with you know, tanks or anything, you know, you just want to be able to deal with that. They, they want to. I, I think that they want to be able to hit. The Nades, get that anti on the field. Mm, Raven is already taking out two though, takes out both their DPS. Yeah, Raven's on the hunt here. So, UFO falling, Ripple Rose being the next up. Now by herself, getting a lot of damage on, doesn't even need a hack. Zan taking that one out. This offense is a rolling, three minutes on the clock. Yeah, you know, the, you know the, they're gonna lose their uh, main shield. Uh, you know, with the Ryan, they're gonna lose that main shield if they, because of the Sombra, if they keep, uh, getting there. Yeah, so, I'm not sure, there we go, okay, yeah, well, now we see, uh, now back, uh, contestant, triggering that one now, but now it's Zan's DPS, Tack Visor, looking for him, does find UFO, Zadka as well, there's the Shatter, Nami Toki, Omna all fighting, Six of their own Lego deleted down this offense stop. And they still have it. 1.32 meters. Uh, now opening back up, but so close to that first point. Yeah, what, like, yeah, just uh, stopping their tracks really. Two minutes on end. That's going to be standard time spent. But uh, but now defense answering uh, answering strongly. Yeah, we're going to see uh, the uh, defense running the Tonzo with, with the having the privilege of running that. Two ultimates, almost three for the side of Stormbreakers, three, almost four for the side of Mjolnir's, but the UFO is starting this one with a pick. Uh, main support now down to this one. that Diva Bomb, it's in a nice spot, oh. but the Legos hacked too late to let the just bomb take them out. Late, yeah, just a second too late to uh, make sure these members are not able to get away from it. Self-destruct of their own, Omna pulling that nano, uh, or sorry, the attack visor again. And Lego's gonna switch on to McCree. Uh, sorry, I'm, I'm mixing things up here. Sorry, that was Amnes. That was super, super interesting. That was, uh, the, I, I, sorry, I thought Xan had attack visor kill and was already a backup of 70%. I was, I was lost. <laughs> no, not so much. Yeah. So, UFO is gonna be the only one here with an ultimate on board. I mean, he's gonna have. Not me, excuse me, he's gonna have that shatter soon. That's really it, except for Zan's. Uh, you know, attack visor, and they're not gonna have it anytime soon. They're gonna be yeah, well, less than a less than a minute left, and still not fast for a This has been a pretty significant hold so far here, Iris. Like, yeah, only seconds mean, to go, and not even first point. Yeah, you know, Rude 66 can be like this. First point is kind of kind of weird. 
Weird indeed. Um, Queen Galaxy gonna have the trans soon, but yeah, I, I'm not even uh, not even the first point. I mean, once they get it there, I feel like it's. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll just kind of see. They've, the defense has shown a lot of really great positioning so far, um, and taken a lot of value with it. We see three members on board with ultimate, basically between Lord Alzami and UFO. Might be planning to do a nano visor. Yeah, that's a classic combination, but Rebel Rose like, hot news in the back from the other dragon, though. Yeah. Able to take oh. out Xanth before they're able to get that visor in. Oh, no. Cloud is guy he does get the nano boost off. Doesn't stay up for it. Time to find picks left and right as this Anna, or Diva. Yeah, Diva, excuse me, is the only one left. Overtime ticking away. They have the Hammond back. Both tack visors are fighting away. Amna wins. As we see Lego the only one back, we might see members able to touch though. Not gonna happen. <laughs> Wolf tag Pfizer is going right after it. No, another there, but uh, no, getting the benefit of an Ana nade. Yeah, talk about some drama, right? I like it. That's like some classic like the medical Overwatch stuff, right? Like Anna helping out uh, helping out Soldier 76. <laughs> you know, yeah, medical some... duels and his quest for justice or whatever, right? Yeah, there's some plot there. Yeah, right there. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Um, wow, okay, so a very significant hold coming on out here from Mjolders. Yeah, Stronger okay. is going to be on the defense now. Not even have to really take it much longer than a... I mean, they have to take it at first point, basically. Yeah, I predict we see a Bastion come out. I'm just... Bastion or Swarb, I predict it. I'll go Bastion. Yeah, oh, I, I mean, that, that, is, that is the meme right there. Pirate shit being very popular here on Route 66, defense... Um, pretty much always opting to, to hold on top of bigger rolls. Yeah, well, yeah let's see what they do. Yeah, that, that's that's basically the place to hold. I, I haven't I haven't seen anything about. It. Mm. I mean, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of cover up there. I mean, vertical positioning is good in any FPS. You know, no matter what you, you know, no matter, no matter what you're talking about, really. Lego over on the May. I like it. And, uh... UFO also on May. Interesting. Uh, switches. It's predict maybe some predicting there. Hmm. Yeah, not 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 against it whatsoever. They both have rhymes. They will both be looking to wall off their opposing Reinhardt. We'll see how UFO and Lego do on these May coming in Route 66. When uh, you know four minutes, not a point, not an entire point is even needed. Yeah, it makes it a little interesting on this map because this map is you know there's that one choke, but there's not a whole lot of there's not a whole. Um, spots the wall to get a, like a big useful wall uh, after kind of after that first little spot there. The rest of the areas have Go ahead. Sorry. Yeah, the rest of the area is pretty strong. Plus the payloads just push right through it. Yeah, they're giving up a lot of ground position. You know, here the May is now over on the top, but it gets frozen out by the other May. Oh like man! Almost, almost able to take out that May with the uh, nade, but they're. Uh, Back in ice block too early. Oh, okay, so Zaka takes the positioning there, a little uh, little yeah. battlefield up top, right in front of the big girls. Uh, you know, the, the May the May one on one goes the side of the defense, but the uh, but Zaka wins the the Diva one on one. I wonder who else will take uh, will take the stage. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna give up that fight. They've got time. My hmm. Raidemus all the way up about halfway to her shatter. Rain Monkey looking to get back into her mech. High noon on point, and the rest of the defense pretty high up there. And Nami is the only one who doesn't have above fifty percent for the offense, though. Yeah, Rain Monkey back in back now. Back yeah, finding all the. Oh, oh, there you go, over the side. The there it is. Nano May. Nano May. Or, Nano May. I think might have jumped away actually. Oh, the, the oh, answer is set that up. It's gonna work for them. It's gonna work for. Them. There's the May, and now the Mother Veil. It's a cold oh, winter, Zan! Zan dead eye! Yeah, gets Rebel Rose out, but Zadka ate the May ultimate from the other side. We see Mjolnir's up on top here. That's a pick! They're rolling in. It's just the May frozen. The May had the Anna frozen right there. It's just oh, the supports over to the side. I don't think they're going to be able to get back here. Rain and Mist shattering oh, down. Shattered. Oh, no! Ray is charged in and got answered with a shatter three meters away. This is in the band hammer. Oh! oh. The owner's pushing it all the way on Route 66 to take it for the Death Blossoms band hammer tournament. Well done. You love to see it. Great job on their part. 
Yeah, I love it. Omni comes in for one game and gets play of the game. I love, you love to see it. You love to see it. This, I mean, really, this Zan, or Zan Widow, uh, sorry, Zan Omni, Soldier 76 one on ones, uh, especially with both of those attack guys just getting pulled at the same time. Well, that was awesome. That that was something that created some uh, Overwatch lore out of or whatever, like we were talking about. Yep. That yeah, was, some was... some Overwatch plot. Yeah, there you go, right. Um, and 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 I mean, like you mentioned too, you know, the the, the and, you know, can't forget the uh, can't forget the support sever was helped out by the uh, well placed and a grenade. But uh, but it is just super cool to see all this, right? Uh, mm -hmm. I'm not coming in and uh, just really showing out. You like to see it. Yeah. So uh, yeah. Uh, did you have any uh, have any statements about that uh, about that last game there? I mean, it was it was just super clean on behalf of uh, um, Mjolnir. They just yeah. you know they just they they you know held them strong and then they pushed and you know they had the time advantage and got their stuff together and they kind of won those fights. I thought that they were maybe gonna have a little bit more action happen that last fight that seemed like they were gonna lose the fight and uh, but they managed to. Keep it going and yeah, yeah, yeah. Win. get the support. I, I think uh, ultimately win. I see what you did there, Iris. We said no puns on this cast. That's your one. You, you, you held out on me until the very, very end of this. I don't appreciate it, but we'll let this one slide. That is the thing I want to talk about here. Um, she, she was getting some massive two or three Ks and stuff, but it really seemed like Stormbreakers were realizing that she was able to hit those angles up top, especially hit certain parts of walls and get that, you know, that Diva Mech to slide down the last, you know, half second or so of mm -hmm. the self-destruct sequence. Um, and Stormbreakers really, I, I think, noticed that and was able to get walls up there, get get away from it, get, you know, the monkey bubbles up in there, you know, to block it off just that last little bit of damage or the Rhine, the Rhine shields and stuff like that. Um, and and, and that, that was a great way to answer that Diva. Now, Zadka was not shut down by any means. Uh, again, we were kind of saying, you know, after after the, the May one on one was won by the Stormbreakers, Zadka took the stage right on up there and won, you know, one on one against her opposing Diva. But uh, but but it was just very interesting to see how the self destructs were were learned against, you know. Mm hmm. Yeah, they, they definitely kind of closed off that that avenue. Um, mm -hmm. You know, it took them through games, but they they you know they they weren't getting the 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 massive bombs that they were having trouble with uh in the past yeah in the, in the previous games uh the watch my gibraltar and stuff but uh yeah uh with that iris i think we have reached my least favorite part of any cast and that is the end unfortunately uh if you unless you had anything else for the good people no not for me all right i'm fbi tugboat casting with me is iris appreciate her as uh, always deluxity down there producing always appreciate that and this again is the Death Blossoms Banhammer One Day Tournament. Uh, if you enjoy the cast and follow us away, I'm FBI Tugboat on Twitter. Iris, send uh, me. I'm, yeah, I'm Mod uh, Modwis Code on Twitter and uh, Modwis Gale on Twitch. So. There you go. Follow away if you enjoyed it. Thanks for tuning in, and Death Blossoms will be back with loads of more fun tournaments like this here soon, guys. Stay tuned. <laughs>